Wednesday night in Cleveland, the U.S. men's national team takes on Belgium, currently ranked 15th in the world in the first of five games over the next three weeks for the U.S. This up-and-coming Belgian squad is one very familiar to the European-based national team players, so we asked them to give us a scouting report on their club teammates. Moussa Dembele and Jan Bertangen. Marwan Fellaini and um, Kevin Morales. Romelu Lukaku. Christian Benteke. Guillaume Gillet. Belgium is up one of the the best teams right now in Europe, you know, very, very good individual players, you know, big names, uh, but also the, as, a, as a nation they're doing extremely well. They're in first place in their World Cup qualifying group, in a very difficult group, and uh, they're going to probably show that uh, in Cleveland. Most of their players play at the top clubs um, around Europe, and we have Marwan Fellaini and um, Kevin Morales, who are two very talented players, classy players. Dembele uh, is, is good on the ball, uh, you know, can dribble out of uh, pressure, uh, create opportunities for his teammates by being able to beat a man, slide someone through, or create a chance for himself to score. Fellaini's been there for a while at Everton, and he's just, uh, he's powerful, he's got really delicate feet. Um, you know, he's a, good, he's a good midfielder, he can also play up top if, if they needed. Um, but again, he's he's more of a, of, of a physical presence. They have a lot of up-and-coming players. Benteki, who was really great uh, this season for Aston Villa. Christian is obviously a strong player. He's he's a physical presence. Um, but in saying that, he's he's soccer smart. You know, he he knows the game. He can link up well. So he's uh, he's going to cause cause a a, a he's going to be a handful for us. Well, the one from Anderlecht is uh, the right back Guillaume Gillet, um, very attacking-minded right back who. Can get up and down a lot. He's got a good engine. He, you know, has great technique, and you know, like I said, he's going to attack a lot from the right back position. Kevin is is kind of the showstopper. You know, he he can produce magic, um, get the ball to his feet in wide areas, and he likes to dribble and turn people. It gets in good crosses. Um, he's a classy finisher in front of goal. The other one I know well, who I used to play with, is Romelu Lukaku. Um, he's a young boy, but he's a big striker with a lot of talent, and uh, you know. He's got some pace, got good technique in the box, and uh, definitely a handful to deal with. Jan uh, is a good center back, was in uh, the team of the season, and, uh, you know, it'll be a tough game. That's what we want to kind of compare ourselves with. You know, we want to play the best, we want to do well against them, we want to play with them and, and, and hopefully beat them at the end of the day. Uh, so this is a next kind of uh, um, yeah, milestone. That's uh, special for me because... Uh, you know, I play against a lot of these guys week in and week out, and you know, a lot of their players play abroad from Belgium, but I still know who they are. They're in the newspaper every week, and you know, I, I've watched the Belgian team and, and followed them closely. And you know, maybe a lot of normal soccer fans in the states don't know, but I, in my opinion, Belgium is one of the best teams in the world right now. They have a lot of talent, and uh, you know, I think it's going to be a good game on Wednesday. A little bit extra special for me. You know, they're they're going to be up for the game, and and. Us as a team, obviously, preparing for the qualifiers, you know, we're going to be up for it, so it should make for an exciting game. You can watch the U.S. take on Belgium from Cleveland live Wednesday night on ESPN. Watch ESPN and Unimas with coverage beginning at 8 p.m. Eastern time. That'll do it for this edition of Studio 90. I've been your host, Alan Hopkins, and we'll see you next time.